These kissing bugs are anything but romantic. The nickname because they often bite people's faces, attracted by their breath. Dr. Sarah Hamer studies the bloodsuckers at Texas A&M University. They're pretty stealthy and elusive because they need to try to find a host. The bugs carry a parasite that can cause Chagas disease. That can be deadly and show up as heart failure years after infection. The bugs are found mostly in Latin America and in the southern U.S., but a girl was recently bitten much farther north in Delaware. And there's a whole range of symptoms, which makes it, again, difficult to diagnose. Those symptoms can include rash, fever, and body aches. The bugs occasionally find their way into cracks in homes and emerge overnight. What's the difference between kissing bugs and bed bugs? Bed bugs are adapted to living where people live and in your bed or in your home. Kissing bugs or triatamines are bugs that live in the wild. So how can you protect yourself? The CDC says remove wood piles and brush from outside your home. And since the bugs are attracted to lights, turn them off inside your home when you go to bed. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.